Are you looking for a new cooling system that can keep your home cool during the hottest days of the summer? Well, look no further as we compare air source heat pumps with air conditioners. The two titans of cooling systems. <laughs> Here at Monkey Ranch, we've installed hundreds of air conditioners, but we've seen how heat pump installations are growing in demand due to their popularity. To keep up with new innovations in cooling systems, our technicians receive specialized training to help homeowners all over Los Angeles and the surrounding areas choose the right cooling system for their homes. And in this video, we'll review the different factors that highlight the differences and shared similarities between air conditioning systems and air source heat pumps so that you can get the right system for your home. And hey, if you're new to this channel, consider subscribing as we're constantly putting out new videos every week. Now let's jump in starting with how air conditioners and air source heat pumps produce cool air in similar ways. Both use a refrigerant cycle to produce cool air. Here's a step-by-step -step process on how they cool your home. Initially, the warm air from indoors is absorbed by the refrigerant in the evaporator coil. The cooled air is then circulated throughout your home using a blower and ducts. The evaporated refrigerant is compressed through a compressor to increase its temperature and pressure. The refrigerant is then transported to a condenser where the absorbed heat is released and it becomes a liquid again and transported back to the evaporator coil to absorb more heat and create the cool air circulating throughout your home. This cooling loop continues until your home reaches a desired temperature set on your thermostat. Even though both systems have similar cooling cycles, the biggest difference between air source heat pumps and air conditioners is that heat pumps can provide heating and cooling, whereas ACs only provide cooling. That's just one major difference, but we'll also look at the following criteria to compare these two systems even further. Cooling functionality, energy efficiency, cost and pricing, installation and maintenance, energy efficiency. Heat pumps and air conditioners have similar energy efficiency ratings. Both have an energy guide label with seasonal energy efficiency ratio too. CR2 ratings, which make it easier for you to compare them in terms of energy savings, the higher the rating, the higher the potential energy savings you can take advantage of in the long term. CR2 ratings range from 14.3 to above 21, and heat pumps have more models with higher ratings than air conditioners. Still, highly energy efficient air conditioning systems are available with similar energy savings as heat pumps. Whether it's a heat pump or an air conditioner, highly efficient cooling systems tend to cost more than lower rated units. Costs are important and we'll cover that next. Due to their heating and cooling capabilities, air source heat pumps tend to cost thousands of dollars more than air conditioners. Despite their higher costs, heat pumps have special rebates available. Although air conditioners have lower price units than heat pumps, these tend to have a lower energy efficiency rating. The pricier AC systems, however, have high CR2 ratings among other features. Operating costs for both air conditioners and heat pumps are impacted by different factors. Running an AC or a heat pump during the hot weather season may lead to high utility bills since both of these systems run off electricity, but if your home has solar panels, these systems can be powered through solar panels to help offset some of the operating costs. Next, we'll look at how ACs and heat pumps compare in terms of insulation and maintenance. Heat pumps and air conditioners require routine maintenance before the start of the summer, but heat pumps need an additional maintenance checkup before the start of the cold weather season. Typical maintenance service includes air filter replacements, airflow tests, and refrigerant level checks. Installing an air conditioner tends to be easier for technicians if they're swapping an old AC for a new one. Heat pumps can be swapped too but in some cases, they may need to be retrofitted to complete the installation. Due to their heating and cooling capabilities, a heat pump installation can also cost more if your home doesn't have the proper electrical panel upgrades to support it. So is a heat pump or an air conditioner right for you? If you're looking to update your home's current heating and cooling system, then a heat pump may be a good fit for you. But if you're looking to replace your cooling system and keep your furnace, then a new air conditioner is ideal. If you're seeking a more energy efficient cooling system, both heat pumps and air conditioners are available with high CR2 ratings. Still, you'll have to consider upfront costs, which means heat pumps are pricier than a new AC. If after considering these factors, you're thinking about a new heat pump or air conditioner and live in Los Angeles or the surrounding areas, you can schedule an appointment with our certified HVAC technicians using the link below in the description. If you found any of the information in this video helpful, make sure to like and subscribe as we are constantly adding new videos every week.